Today, the owner of the Southern or a Southern Indiana funeral home where dozens of decomposed bodies were found was back in court, now changing his plea to guilty. Last year, authorities found bodies at Langford Funeral Home in Jeffersonville decomposing in multiple rooms instead of being properly cared for. Some families of the deceased saying that the owner, Randy Langford, told them their loved ones were cremated when they weren't. Langford was then charged with negligence and intentional inflection of emotional distress. WHAS 11's Alexis Jones was in the Indiana courtroom today. She has more on Langford's change of plea. Mark Price, Beth Cooper, Pam Price, Kalita Williams, Stacy Williams, Larry Williams, Derek Kessinger. Names of loved ones who waited months to hear this change of plea. Guilty. Randy Langford agreed to a 12 year sentence where he will spend the first four years in home incarceration, then the remaining time on probation. According to his plea agreement, Langford is required to pay up to $46,000 in restitution. Prosecutors say his funeral director license may also be revoked. However, Derek Kessinger says this isn't the justice he was hoping for. It doesn't mean anything, but um, I do forgive him uh, for what he did, um, and I hope that he can find forgiveness. Clark County Prosecutor Jeremy Mole says he's pleased with today's outcome. It's important as a prosecutor in a case to say, uh, can we get this resolved? Can we get convictions? Can we get an executed jail sentence? Can we get people their restitution that they're due and do that on a timely basis? And we were able to do that in this case, and I'm pleased with that. Langford is set to appear in court for sentencing on June 23rd, then again on September 20th for his restitution hearing. In Jeffersonville, Alexis Jones, WHS 11, on your side.